My name is Mimi Lian, and I'm the set designer for a public reading of an unproduced screenplay about the death of Walt Disney. I started out studying architecture in college, um, so I guess that, that's, that's what I would say is, is my background and what I draw upon a lot when I'm thinking about a design for a play. As the title suggests, um, it's, it's a public reading, so the audience is, is sort of intrinsic to the, uh, the, the event, really. So it immediately became clear to me that the design needed to include the audience. Like whatever the design was, whatever the nature of the space, it, it would be a complete space that encompassed the audience. Um, and from there, you know, we just started talking about different uh, ideas of what this room would feel like. Um, one initial impulse I had just from reading the script, um, it made me think of this airport chapel that I <laughs> wandered into while I was on a layover in the Munich airport. And it was just this, you know, this, this very neutral, heavenly feeling room, but there was something kind of somber or funereal even about it. Um, and it was very transient, you know, it was in an airport. So it was, uh, you know, it just felt like this room that was floating um, in the middle of in the middle of whiteness, this sort of white box. Um, and then this idea of a screening room. And then also we thought about um, boardrooms. Um, and so eventually I feel like we have created a room that evokes sort of all three, you know, like a boardroom, a screening room, and also sort of a funeral chapel. I think I really believe that three-dimensional space is something to be harnessed for dramatic purposes. <laughs> Um, and I think that maybe is just coming from my background in architecture where you're taught always to kind of think about experiencing space, you know, while moving through it. You know, the audience is the person who's walking through the building. And so you think about the effects of the volumes of spaces that you walk through and whether it's a constricted space or a voluminous space. Um, these are all things that are, that I think are incredibly powerful um, and ought to be experienced by the audience member and that, you know, the three-dimensional space that's designed, um, it seems a shame to only see it from one side.